version control is a very powerful feature of key file workspace and is used particularly for reports which are going to undergo many modifications that are reviewed and shared between many users. Here we have a document we worked with before. We know it's a Word document and let's say for the purpose of this lesson that it is a document that is un going to undergo modifications and review. It is currently not under version control and I can tell that because the document icon doesn't have a red tick. You'll see this appear once I put it under version control. To put a document under version control we have to explicitly ask for version control to be applied to this document. Right mouse on the document and bring up the context menu for that document. Version control is an available option. I select version control and notice that I get a dialog box which allows me to check it out. First of all I can add in comments and add in some text. Secondly, I can add a new label to this document or leave it blank as I wish. The new label allows us to carry forward any company standards we have for version control documents. I'm going to leave this blank for the moment. Publishing is a feature that we use when we've completed our version control modifications and wish to show everybody the latest version of this document in a shared environment. I also have the opportunity to set the version number that I wish to use with this document or if I don't wish to use any version numbering I can switch it off. I'm going to press OK. Notice now the document on my Windows desktop has been changed to an icon with a tick. This tells us that Keyfile Workspace knows this is a document under version control, even though I still haven't made any modifications to the document itself. Let's have a look at the context menu and see what we get now. Straight away I have a different menu option available to me. It's called Show History. If I go into Show History it shows me that I have one current revision which has not been checked in and checked out again and it has a revision number of one with no modified label.